57 Chocolate is the pioneer bean to bar chocolate manufacturing company located right here in Accra, Ghana. So we at Wahoo Mobility have a vision for transitioning the world to sustainable fleets. Firstly, we locally design and manufacture electric vehicles. And then secondly, we are creating a community of electric vehicle riders and drivers. Integrocraft is a handmade chocolate company. We specialize in the production of chocolates and cakes. Beam Africa is a communication platform that helps businesses to grow and then engage their customers. We operate in over 25 countries in Africa. Golden Port Company Limited, we are a cocoa manufacturing company. So we have the powder itself, the sweetened chocolate powder. And we have the unsweetened chocolate powder. And then we have Cuvita. And then the cosmetics line, that is Henima. As we all know, Sub-Saharan Africa has a very youthful population, but unfortunately, a lot of high unemployment rates. And so what we're doing here at 57 Chocolate is we're taking young people, we're training them, giving them skills, an avenue to experiment, create, and add value to local resources we have here in Ghana. We believe by 2028, uh, we would have created more than 100,000 sustainable jobs for African youth, not just in the delivery and courier space, but also for our, our young people who are engineers. So we have something called champions. We are looking at uh, developers who are doing so well, developing applications and all that. We provide them with free versions of our platforms to be able to, to scale, to, to grow their skills and then also to, to grow their business as well. So in the Opodine community in the Eastern region, we built a one unit classroom for the people in the community. It has been great being part of the ITC Netherlands Trust Fund Accelerator 5. They have really helped us develop growth strategies for how we scale up our business and also put us in touch with viable partners uh, who can both offtake our vehicles and help us with our supply chain. Uh, we have gotten a lot of impact from them through their trainings. They talked about how we have to go ahead and doing our packaging. They even gone through how we have to do our marketing strategies. We've also been to most fairs with them, that is both national and international, which gave us more exposure into the market. We, have, we got a lot of people calling us. So some of the challenges we face are access to raw materials. As we all know, Ghana does grow cocoa, but Ghana doesn't necessarily have a milk powder industry. So, for example, we have to source milk powder and importing products into the country is quite expensive. So that's one of the challenges. And then another issue we have to has to do with machines. You know, we are into handmade chocolates and then we are thinking of growing or doing from bean to bar all machine machinery so that we can do less of the handmade. So really at the stage that we're at as a business, one of our main needs is really to access patient capital for R&D and then also to be able to find financiers who are interested in brokering carbon asset finance agreements. Because of where we produce our products from uh, free zones and the free zones when you produce and you have to bring it out, it's like you are bringing the product from outside. So the taxes are very high. So if they can work something for us, for us when we are bringing the product from the free zones and then to be a little cheaper, the taxes. We're also looking for partners, distribution partners, retail partners across the globe, specifically um, in Asia and other parts of Africa, in Europe and also in America. Uh, in the future, uh, we are hoping that the resources that we are providing to our champions, that is the developers, would help them to upskill and then grow to their full potential. We are also hoping that 
the communication platform that we are giving to businesses would help them to also grow across Africa. We want to expand and then explore more in the international market. And then we are also aiming at getting a higher percent, greater portion of the market share in Ghana here. And our future goal, because we are producing uh, our products from Google Processing Company for now, we want to aim to have our own factory and then have uh, a chocolate academy, which we can train people that they can even do make their own chocolate. I know that it's possible, but it's only possible if we all crowd in um, to create this new opportunity in our environment.